Are you thinking of placing your adult child on your deed? Well, many people have thought of this strategy because they want to avoid inheritance tax, probate, or maybe they want to protect an asset from long-term care. Well, this solution may not be the best. And as you'll see, I'm going to go over the top five risks of placing your adult child on your deed. Number one, taxes. By adding another person to your deed, you're actually giving them a gift. And by them receiving this property, it may trigger a gift tax situation. Most of our clients will not have this problem because the gift tax exclusion is over $11 million. But if you are putting your name with another property owner on a deed, it may trigger you to file a gift tax return. Gifts transfer the original cost of the home to the owner. So for example, if you added your son to a deed and your home is worth $250,000, well now half of that $125,000 will be attributed to your son and they will have a cost, a tax in other words, if they were to sell their side of the property. Number two, lawsuits. If your son or daughter is added to your deed, your property is now exposed to their situations if God forbid they're sued or if they have creditor issues or if they have bankruptcy matters. Now, you may have a son or daughter who is very responsible with money, but you have to think ahead that these situations could occur and now your home is involved with their matter. Number three, unanimous consent. When you add another individual to your deed, you need everybody to be in agreement if you want to get a mortgage, if you want to get a home line of credit, or if you want to refinance. And if you don't, you will be unable to do this. And if you already have a mortgage on your property, you have to notify your mortgage company that you're adding another person to your deed, and they may ask you to do a refinance. Number four, death of a child. We don't want to think about it but there is a possibility that your adult child could predecease you. And if so, it really depends on how your deed is worded. If your deceased child has family members or is married, you may be owning a home with your son-in-law or your daughter-in-law. If that's not your plan, you may not want to add their name to the deed. And number five, taking consideration if you only put one child on your deed, what if you have more children? Divvying up the property will be very difficult when you die if you only put one child on your deed. You will be unable to distribute the rest of the property to your other children because they are now in total ownership of that property. And there you have it, the top five risks of placing your adult child on your deed. Believe it or not, there are many more please, I encourage you to contact our office, make an appointment with our team, and we can go over all of the issues and complications of adding your adult child to a deed and making sure we get you to a solution.